Hey everybody, so today I have another tip for you. Today we're going to manipulate and change our hotbar. Uh, many of you might not know this. Uh, many in our company didn't know this, including me. So let's go ahead and give you a bit of a rundown on how to change your hotbar. So we're going to hit the tab here. We're going to go down to our hotbar. So first of all, I never like these icons. They're too big. They're in my way, blah, blah, blah. I never like where my stamina is, especially when I'm doing the research here. Uh, when I'm crafting, it kind of clips through that a bit. And I think my bar is a little too big anyway so what I can do is right click the bar and first of all you can add uh, different emotes on the bar directly if you didn't know that so I can now go ahead and hit six ha 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 I'm so excited because about this and we can clear the slot if you didn't know that and there's also an edit mode here now you might have two other bars here I deleted mine but what you can do is right click anywhere and add a new bar and this bar you can actually go ahead and change the scale of it what you want and we can go here and add another emote so we can put giggle in this <laughs> and you can actually go ahead and set a uh, quick bar hotkey so that would switch to that hotbar. You can also do a uh, slot hotkey. Uh, you can also go crazy and increase, uh, decrease the scale here and then increase the amount of buttons you have to probably more than I've seen even in WoW before. Uh, so there you go. Look at all that. So if somebody was bored enough, they could literally set each one of these with an emote or something just to be silly. But uh, I'm not that bored, so I'll leave that to somebody else to do. But that is the power of this. And there's even a hide delay here, so you know if the bar hides and disappears on people. If you want to fix that or increase it, you can do that quite a bit here. So that's pretty cool. So let's set it to 10. And um, let's put it to a scale of... Let's do a scale of 85, I like, actually. Cool. And then let's go ahead and take these guys. We can shrink these guys. Those are those icons that I don't really use anyways. These are your research and crafting, but we use the hotkeys. So we'll go like that. We're going to take you and put you here. So we're going to put you more down in the middle here. And then let's go ahead and put you down here. We'll just clip you over there because I think, yeah, because the bar will be in the thing there anyways. We're just going to set you guys down here so it's a little cleaner for us. So you can go ahead and line it up a wee bit there. I guess they could be kind of close. It doesn't really matter anyways, right? So they can overlap. It won't look... Yeah, it looks fine there. And there you go. And then we can go and unedit the bar. And there we go. How cool is that? So my bars are there and I can still use them just normal. And uh, it gives me a bit more flexibility, which I, I like quite a bit. And I thought you guys would like that. And you can actually right click your um, chat as well and customize it so look at all the options you have in chat i'm not sure if you guys ever right clicked it but look at the ridiculous amount of options here you do have the new tabs and stuff here but uh, you have a lot of uh, filtration and uh, options with this so i won't go through all that because you guys uh, can do that yourself but you can uh, for example uh, just filter all the chat here and just have admin in here and system so if you've been on a long time and wondering all these system chats and things like that you can actually set up a dedicated uh, chat for that as well which is really cool you can you know keep one that's just for company and this is great because like in a lot of games when you add a filter uh, like this a new channel it doesn't take the current log in there and then you're kind of screwed right but with this one you can actually filter out what you've already had and it does a really good job with that so basically what we can do is do station only chat zone chat things like that and it's just it's really good uh for that you can do just company chat here and so for you guys like me who record maybe later on your company's at war or there's some things that maybe you don't want to share with everyone when i do my videos for example i can now take company off my general chat and just hide that for privacy reasons if that was needed and uh yeah so that's pretty cool i, I really really like that so lots of ui customization you just have to realize you can right click uh just to give you an idea when you go to the auction house and you sell ores um, when you right click the ores, you can actually sell more with the right click, for example. Um, and you can actually say, hey, sell 20. Um, so basically, keep in mind that right click doesn't exist for quite a few things, not everything. And the UI is actually very work in progress. Keep that in mind as well. There's going to be a huge overhaul in the inventory system in hopefully in a couple of months or so. But uh, anyways, just some tips there for you guys to customize your game, your chat, your, your, your hot bars and all that. And uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, and we'll see wonderful people next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.